Hello guys, in today's video, I'm going to show you how I treat cryptocurrencies and manage my million dollars crypto trading fund, right? So crypto trading is right now is really, really hot. There are so many cryptocurrencies you can choose and so many market volatility that happening every single day. So what is your way to trade cryptocurrencies? From what I heard, right, a lot of people do it in this way, right? Either they go to the Twitter, they follow some big whales, right, to see how they tweet and what they are talking about. When they say that I'm buying something, they just jump right in to copy, copy the trading ideas. Or they follow those uh, currencies, right, to see what happened, what they are updating, and they just jump right in, right? So that's how they trade. Another way is instead of going to Twitter, they go to the Discord, some uh, online communities, right, to chat with other people. And people are here in the community to discuss about their trading ideas, to just copy from it and to trade, right? And guess what? Both of the ways are not consistent at all, right? Because if there's something wrong with the cryptocurrencies, they do not know what is the right thing to do and what is projected uh, price point to add it, right? So to me, those are not the good way to trade, especially they are not a consistent way to trading in the market and to make money, right? So you might want to ask, what is my answer to trading cryptocurrencies? My answer in simple word is, trading in a systematic manner instead of out of your emotion or out of your you know some sometimes your gut feeling no that's not the right way to do it everything through strictly based on the model and the data right so every single day the market is moving at right and the, every single market is updating and you have a model to analyze all the different model, all the different markets on the back end, and then generate some consistent trading ideas and signals for you so that you can pick it up. Or you can do it, you can do it manually to trading based on one or two trading signals, or otherwise you can trade full like me, fully automated, right? I have a robot to trade for me based on the data to make the decisions to actually uh, run the best prediction uh, you can find out out of the data and also run the risk management to strictly set some risk constraints on your positions. So let's check out on what I'm talking about. Okay, so this is the product I'm using is called AlphaGen. And uh, with AlphaGen, every single day, basically for your crypto market, right, you have two reports to review, right? One report is called the, um, let's see, it's called the current date holding, uh, um, report right this is currently uh, this report is for the Binance uh, exchange and uh, it's generating for just today right and every single day the model will run automatically there's another beauty about a systematic trading that you don't need any human effort once you have the model set up right it will automatically run every single day to analyze more than 400 uh, markets right without any human efforts right and they will update and generate some trading signals and what is the trading signal looks like right it will looks like just this right so each day uh, this is one of the report right it will tell you that what is my current day holding based on the model right there's some fields right now right the number one is asset right is how what cryptocurrency i'm trading right now number two is called a prediction confidence this is based on your trading signals rule you set up and go to the history to back test and see the result i will show you a bit more details on this uh, second thing is about the current holding either long or short right they will tell you what you should do uh um, what you're currently holding based on your uh, default uh, uh, your account size, right? Say you have five thousand dollars of the USD dollars to trade on one of the market. What is the right holding? What's the right size that you should hold, right? In this case, for this particular crypto asset, it tells you that this is the right size you should hold. And the holding prior day, uh, where obviously is a prior day holding. If you see the difference between holding and holding prior day, it means that 
the current day, we have more holding. We're adding more positions into it, right? Uh, the entry day is means that when the signal was triggered, and entry price means that uh, when the price, uh, which at which price point that you enter a new positions. Stop loss price is a pro projected uh, stop loss, right? So before you even enter the positions, you know when to exit, where to exit before you even start. That's the way I talk about the systematic trading matters that you can never go wrong because you know how much you're going to lose in the worst case scenarios. So you're making the decisions, right? Not just by the step one, right? You're instead of making the decisions based on step one, two, three, right? What happened if the position goes well, what will you do? And then what happened if the position didn't go well, what would you do, right? To uh, stop the loss and exit instead of holding the losing position over and over again and making the lose continue to grow, right? And uh, this, uh, the next, next field is about the backtest graph, right? As I mentioned that you have have the prediction confidence, right? This is a basically like a score. But how do we calculate the score? And that's the way to calculate the score. If you click into it, you can see the whole C3 of the back testing of this uh, particular group of assets. Each red dot here is a short position. And uh, if I open another one, I can see uh, each green dot there is a long position to those two obviously in the history we mostly generated some short positions and the other line here is actually the pnl the profit and loss performance out of this cryptocurrencies so if we short based on the signal right we can see that this is a return we can realize that very good return and uh, based on the model, we will calculate some statistics, right? Hit rate is about how much of the trade are uh, right, uh, are correctly predicted. Uh, gain loss ratio is based on uh, when you are right, right, about the trading directions, how much money you expect to make on average comparing to uh, when you are wrong and you're losing and cutting the uh, cutting the loss right and the last it's about a Kelly formula is another uh, prediction confidence uh, score here you can say you can sync it just like uh, the prediction confidence I showed you a bit right so this is more like the explanation about the prediction confidence in another way right and uh, last but not least when you feel comfortable about the trading signal the direction and the trading entry price and stop loss price you can actually enter the trade right either you can do it manually with one click you're going into your trading website you can place log into your account and place the trade right and second way is you can click onto the automation here right and with the automation you can actually go and contact us and uh, to say what is your trading idea and how you want to trade this market right we can provide a fully automated systematic trading service Right, because if you go through all the trading signals, even though uh, it's, uh, it's it's a lot of work, right? Because you have to review every single signals and manually enter the trade, right? So what I suggest, uh, what I do for my own systematic trading fund is I do not, you know, enter the trade manually because this will be too many works, right? So I have a trading bot to run based on exact signals I'm showing right here and to trade and rebalance my portfolio every single day. So that I don't have to do the work, right? You, there are so many uh, systematic trading uh, crypto signals and so many cryptocurrencies, right? So that you can fully diversify your portfolio instead of betting on one idea and one direction. You diversify into like 20 or 30 different cryptocurrencies, right? So if one cryptocurrency market went wrong, it could not jeopardize your entire portfolio. And that's the beauty about the systematic trading and that's the right way you should em uh, employ it, right? So every decision right here is made based on the data on the model instead of out of your emotion or out of some whale, whale's uh, tweet, right? And uh, also every trading idea, every trading idea's performance can be back tested from the history. You can from, look to the history and know that what happened to the market based on this rule and what is a, uh, what is a, um, testing performance from it right so that's the idea and how i want to trade the cryptocurrency market right oh you should notice that there are two reports generated for each single market every single day uh, the first one i show you is currently holding is a total holding i'm holding for this position for this model right another report is called the net change 
since prior day, right? It's uh, this one is actually the uh, differences from current holding and prior day holding. So say uh, there's some report that uh, current day, uh, yesterday I'm holding zero position on this particular uh, cryptocurrencies. This day I'm shorting it and uh, for this such amount, right? And or if the prior day you could short this amount, the second day you could short another different amount, right? Or the prior first uh, first uh, the prior day you could holding a long position and current day you just added everything. You you have a flat position on this particular cryptocurrencies. That means you're added the positions. So those two reports will update every single day every single day i don't in yeah uh, i don't interrupt with the rules right i just let it play and let it uh, automatically rebalance my portfolio to generate my consistent report right so this is the best way i think to trade actually no matter what happened in the market right you don't follow the rumors you don't follow your emotion you just let the rules to play and the rules are projected are predicted and uh, are back tested before you even roll it out right so this is the most consistent way to trade and this is actually most of the community uh, most of the communities uh uh, trading communities like the institutional level how they trade on their portfolios and their uh, positions right and this is the right way i suggest you to trade so check out my product uh our product alphagen right now uh if you're interested right we have a three different level we covered uh, most of the trading strategies most of the trading markets and the cryptocurrencies and also it's very easy to use as i just show you right you don't have to do anything to set up the cryptocurrency trading signals you just go there and you can just uh, uh apply the signal into your trading right and we have a large uh, com uh systematic trading communities that you can join us and to discuss on our trading idea or particular strategies. And this is the total cryptocurrencies we covered. And we have three different layers of the membership you can join to become a member of us and to uh, have this trading, uh, systematic trading success in your trading, right? So this is uh, all about Alpha Gen. Alpha is about uh, trading success, right? Gen is generation it means that every single day the model and the data will work together to generate the systematic trading signals for you to make you trade consistently instead of auto your motion or breaking rules right so you will see your success see your alpha through the systematic trading in cryptocurrency space with our platform and applications and uh, ch uh, check this out and uh, give it a try and i bet you will like it right so i'll see you next time for your, for my next video and uh, i hope you will enjoy the rest of your day